what is going on guys welcome back to the channel and for this one man i had a question from one of you guys asking me what character did i use to beat proxima on phase 19 in under 100 seconds now 100 seconds seems like a lot of time but believe me what i say when you get to stage 19 you'll see that that's not a lot of time even if you're using some of the best characters in the game and why this is important is because stage 19 is obviously just before stage 20 and we recently found out that from these special world boss booty boxes you can actually get premium comic cards and on top of that you can get ctp and it's confirmed that you can get a ctp of energy which is arguably one of if not the best ctp in the game so a lot of people if not everyone is now on the grind to get to stage 20 as quickly as possible and while you can most definitely just pay the crystals to get ahead I'm personally not a fan of that, especially with the amount of premium uniforms that we're getting and the amount of uniforms as a whole that we're getting. Like last update is 10, this one we're looking at 7. So me spending my crystals on something I can just easily beat, well, it's not easy, honestly, it's not. But for something I can already do, doesn't seem like a good idea some of you guys may not be able to do it but believe me when i show you what i'm gonna do i feel like a lot of you guys can already do this because some of you guys have your characters built significantly better than i have mine built so the characters that i'm gonna tell you guys i personally think can clear this thing in under 100 seconds is without a doubt obviously a tier 3 captain america but how many of you guys are gonna have tier 2 captain america like not a lot okay so he's immediately off the list the number one character here is probably going to be winter soldier in his new uniform and once i get his uniform to mythic i'm definitely going to give you guys some gameplay i'm going to try to pull it off for you guys but the character that i'm able to do it with right now consistently is actually god silver are you surprised obviously not quicksilver is my guy he's the one that i actually used to clear this and i'm going to show you guys exactly how i did it okay the other characters that i think can really do it here is wolverine if you try not to get debuff yes proxima can debuff you if you see that you get debuff you're gonna need to tag out or just redo it because you don't have that much time to really waste here another character that could potentially do it would be the hulk or black panther if you have their uniform at mythic obviously you need hulk in his ragnarok uniform but i think they're gonna struggle so i think you should stick to winter soldier and quick silver if you don't have a tier 3 captain america those are the characters i think would really do well here even though apocalypse is really really strong he relies very heavily on his fort skills so i really don't see you having enough time to get this thing done using apocalypse so i would say stick the quicksilver if you're struggling here don't pay the crystals honestly i don't think you should 75 crystals might not seem like a lot to you guys but with as many premium stuff that we have in the game right now every crystal counts at least in my book so i'll show you guys how i did it and i'll give you guys my game plan and that way you guys could potentially do it for yourself now what you're gonna need to do here is you're gonna need the big bad beast okay you're definitely gonna need beast he's a key part of this team guys so the team that you're seeing right here is the team that we're gonna be using we're gonna use beast for his lead quicksilver for the dps and we're gonna use colson for his tier 2 passive and i ideally recommend colson because that's gonna give you some more guaranteed crit as well as the amazing damage to superhero types so the game plan here guys is gonna look something like this beast for his leadership obviously which is one of the best in the game and really really intricate part of this team believe it or not so what you're gonna need to do here at the start of the fight is hit the fifth skill with beast to buff quicksilver then tag beast out and then you want to tag in quicksilver and then you want to do five cancel four with quicksilver then you want to hit your team up skill and sometimes that would trigger quicksilver's fourth skill again if you get really lucky and that would be really good to help bump out some more damage for you after that you just want to push with quicksilver by just going something like five four maybe two or three if you need to dodge and then once you see that proxima gets to times 11 hp where she runs up to the top of the map and starts trying to kill you with those lightning bolts you want to tag beast back in and then you want to dodge after you dodge and you see that the lightning bolts have stopped raining down you then want to buff again tag quicksilver back in and then you want to go ahead and use five cancel four and if you need to dodge, use the two, but if not, use the three to buff yourself because as you can see right here, Quicksilver will um, buff himself if you don't have a really, really good 
I so set on him. So yeah, I'll show you guys the build for my Quicksilver and then we'll jump into the gameplay really, really quickly because I don't want to keep you guys too long, okay? So as you can see right here, my Quicksilver is not a top tier Quicksilver by any means. So that's why I confidently feel like you guys can definitely do this too. So don't pay the crystal, guys. It just takes a little bit of practice and I'll show you guys exactly how I did it in 100 seconds, okay? So as you can see, 113 for attack speed, 71% for critical rate, 200% for critical damage, 42% for ignore defense, Defense and 50% for reduced cooldown duration. As for his gears, as you can see, two physical attack and two critical rate for every single slot. And like I said, the skills are at six. Rotation is going to be five, cancel four. Then if you need to dodge some of the attacks that Proxima has going on, you use the two. If not, you want to buff yourself with the three skill if your ISO set is not giving you a bonus that is above 30%. Okay, as you can see for me, it's only giving me 22%. So that's why it's an intricate part of my strategy to use the third skill. As you can see, you're definitely going to need a damage proc here as high as possible. So with that said, guys, let's go ahead and jump into the gameplay with the hot dog eating legend of Marvel Future Fight. Absolutely love me some Quicksilver, guys. And there you guys have it, man. We pulled it off in, what, 75 seconds? And that was not even a perfect run. I made a lot of mistakes, missed the proc a few times, and goddamn, nice, level 52. Okay, boys, and we even got blessed with some freaking cosmic cube fragments okay not the best run but it is definitely good enough to get the job done because quicksilver is just that good so for any of you guys who are struggling look no further quicksilver is the guy especially when you're rocking with this team i'm telling you guys beast lead quicksilver for the dps coasting for the support and go with five damage buffing strikers skip anti-venom for this one and you'll be good because you don't need to rely on the healing just rely on getting out as much damage as possible but that's it for this one thanks for watching peace out